Hey guys, Cody Schwab here. This is going to be a really quick video uh, about using GAC 800 uh, crazing reduction medium uh, and fluid paints and water. Um, I'm going to show you the finished product. I didn't record it because I didn't even think that. I was just messing around, but it actually turned out really good. So I'm going to kind of tell you how I did it just so you can try it yourself. But again, I, I don't have footage of it. Uh, so basically, here is the final result. Let me, uh, I'm going to flip that around. Sorry. Um, I gotta kind of manipulate because my gloves are strong. Okay, so it's kind of hard to see, um, but I used turquoise, black, white, and gold, and that is the final uh, piece. And it actually looks pretty sick um, as a finished piece. And I'm actually extremely happy with it. Um, so what I did was I actually had a bluish background already down. Okay, so you should note that. Um, actually, you can kind of see it where the GAC uh, didn't cover all of it. You can actually see like it's it thinned out. So there was a, a bluish kind of turquoise background. It was really light. Um, so just so you know, I did put a background on this thing. So... I've come to realize that I really don't like, unless the, the white, the uh, the piece specifically uses white, I don't like to have a white background. Um, so on this piece I had a light, almost a tur like a turquoise background already. And then what I did was I took this, uh, I took the GAC 800 and I'm actually out. So that's why I was just messing around because I, I didn't have a whole lot left. Um, I actually didn't even have enough to cover the canvas. So let me get to that. Um, so what I did is I poured all the GAC in the middle. Okay. And then I used a bunch of uh, fluid acrylics. So I used um, Artist Loft because I got those on sale. So I was actually just get, trying to get rid of them. Um, I used Golden Cobalt, Cobalt Turquoise. And then I used um, this Decor uh, Metallic Gold. Okay. And what I did was I poured the GAC right here in the middle. And then I just basically put dots or lines of it in there. I kind of gave it a little swirl through it. Uh, and then I just started tilting the canvas so that it poured <clears throat> all over the canvas. Well, because I didn't have, I'm sorry, it's windy. Uh, because I didn't have enough GAC 800 uh, or GAC, I don't know if people call it that. Um, so I didn't have enough um, golden, the medium, uh, to actually spread across the canvas because as I started tilting it um, I noticed that it was actually start it was barely reaching the edges um, so what I did was I just started spraying I sprayed the canvas all around and then I sprayed the the medium itself and just kept tilting and what's really cool is it it not only stretched it out um, but it also made the paint run and so now you have like pieces like this where the where the white and the black and all of the turquoise ran down and so I just kind of went with it like I just basically took that design where it was already dripping and just tilted it and just kept kind of shaking it to get all of the coverage um, and that's actually how it turned out so this piece actually turned out really cool I'm very very impressed and, and surprised and, and pleased with it um, so that's it guys um, and then I like I said I just sprayed the paint as it was going and the, the you know the paint ran and kind of uh, layered and, and melted together so yeah so again all it was was a GAC 800 a canvas with a little bit of color on it already it was a color that I was going to use or similar um, again I already had like turquoise on there and then used turquoise on top um, used a spray bottle to make it run and then used fluid acrylics inside the GAC um, hopefully this video was helpful if you really like this please uh, check me out on other social medias, visit my website, and be sure to like and subscribe to this video. I'll catch you guys in another one. See ya.